guys. So not too long ago, I released a video talking about things that the community wants to see added to Ropeds. So today, we're gonna go through my list that I created and talk about things I would like to see come to the game. If you're excited, make sure you leave a like and subscribe. It's super simple and free, but let's get started. My first suggestion is to add the water back to the main map so that we can use the boats. If you guys didn't know, the Ropet city center never actually used to look like this. A long, long time ago, it had a completely different layout, and they actually had water around the map. A good example of this is right here in this area, underneath the pet shop. This used to be all water right here, and it would flow through the Ropet's map, and it would go actually around the city center. Quite honestly, I think it would be nice if they added the water back, especially if the beach party location on the map isn't permanent. Two, right here on the map actually used to be a bridge. It wasn't just a flat road. And there was water underneath the bridge. Once again, it would kind of go around the whole map and you actually had to like walk over the bridge or drive over it to get to the other side. In addition to adding water back, I think they should add fishing to the game. Perhaps they should add a fishing island, similar to how they have the beach island, you know. I think that they should add a fishing shop where you could buy fishing rods, maybe even have a leveling system for fishing. Like you could start at level 1 and like reach level 50 and you could earn rewards along the way. And those fish that you catch, you could sell them for coins and maybe some of those fish that are like better than the others could sell for gems instead of coins. I think that would be a really fun mini game and it would give you something to do inside of the game. All right, the park area. I think they should revamp the park area. So this is kind of what we got currently going on in the park. It's, it's nothing crazy, honestly. And I think they should revamp it, make it more like a playground. And then also, I think they should add a pet obstacle course in the park. And you could have your pets run in the obstacle course. And I mean, maybe they could even compete with other pets in, like in your server or something. You know, just another fun activity to do in the game. All right, so for this one, I'm in the cafe because it is add jobs to the game. So my first thought was you could work at the cafe and you could take orders. So we had in the holiday update 2021, a game where you would fulfill orders and you would earn whatever the currency was. Sorry, I forgot. And then additionally, with the launch of Ropets recently with the beach party, we actually got a similar game to that. You know, it would show you an order on the screen and you feed the whale and you could earn beach coins from that. Well, what if they added a job like that, but a permanent one into the cafe here and you could earn coins or gems from it. And two, there are so many other jobs that they could add into the game. In my other suggestions video from the community, we talked about a pet shop job where you could clean up the pet shop. Maybe you could work as a fashion designer at the fashion shop, stuff like that. The next idea is to add a gifting system and a post office to the game. So imagine they had a post office and imagine if you could actually gift items to other players through the mail. It could be to anyone who has their gift settings on. So you can turn on and off trade requests. I think you can turn off friend circle requests or stuff like that. But what if you could turn on and off gift settings? There would be like who can gift items to me through the mail, everyone, friends, or no one. You know, something like that. All right, so the next one has to do with the obbies. And I think that they should add new obby courses to the game with different rewards. So. Right now, if you complete an obby, it gives you, I think, like 10 gems. I could be wrong about that. And I think it gives you some coins, too. Additionally, you can earn coins from checkpoints in the obby. Wow, I just failed. I think that players have kind of started to not really care about the obby. At least myself, I haven't. I don't really do the obby anymore because it's just kind of become very repetitive. And I just don't find it as fun as it used to be. You know, the Ropets community used to gather actually every night and do the obby together, but we stopped doing that because, I mean, it just kind of got tiring and repetitive after a while. So perhaps if they were to add new obby courses, it would be new content for players. And two, what if they added different rewards? Maybe you don't just get gems and coins. What if 
they gave you like a certain pet egg or something you know some stuff like that different rewards that would come with different obbies so it's like one obby would have some rewards one would have a different one just more exciting things for players to kind of look forward to all right the next one has to do with the fashion shop and that is to add a fashion show mini game where you could dress up your pet to a theme and compete with others in public servers. Now this would kind of be similar to uh, the game, I think it's called Dress Your Pet or something like that. It's something along the lines of that. But maybe there was like a theme each round and you'd actually have to like dress your pet up and then people could vote on like the best pet and stuff like that. Because right now, I don't really ever go in this fashion shop unless I have a pet task for it. And I don't really see a use for it other than role playing, which I feel like not a lot of people role play in this game. So maybe adding something along the lines of that would be good. All right, so I'm currently in my yard right now and I'm thinking, what if they added a farming feature where you could grow like different crops or stuff like that in your yard? Like you could grow some of the food in row pets instead of just buying it. I think that would be really cool if you could have like farming and you could have levels, maybe there could be a leveling system involved and you could earn rewards for leveling up, you know, stuff like that. Too, I think it would be kind of cool if maybe they could add like a farm egg with the update and they could add farm pets and stuff like that. Another idea is what about an auction house? What if you could actually sell your inventory items for coins and gems? Kind of like trading, except instead of receiving items back, you would receive coins or gems and you could price your items. Of course, there would have to be a limit so that it wouldn't be too crazy, but I think that would be a really, really cool idea. And my final idea is to add a school and a movie theater to the game. I think those two locations would be really cool to have in game. A school would be really fun, especially if they could add, you know, more features with the school. Um, and maybe they could even add some ridiculous pets like a ruler or something, you know, you know. <laughs> maybe they could add like classes. Your pet could have to go to school and like have different classes or you could earn uh, coins or gems for classes. I don't know, something like that. And then a movie theater. It doesn't have to have actual movies, of course, but just a movie theater would be fun to have on the map, in my opinion. But that's all that I have for today, guys. If you guys enjoyed this video, please give it a like and hit the subscribe button because it is completely free. Let me know down below, is there anything else you'd like to see added into the game? But thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you soon with a brand new video. Bye, everyone!